In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create an acceding chart in RenWeb1. So from the login, I'm going to go up to Classroom. I'm going to pick one of my classes. So once it loads, there we go. Now I need to select a date where I'm actually going to have attendance. So right now, I'm actually doing this before the school year starts, so I have to jump a few days. So 27 so the 17th there we go so let's pick CP algebra 3 now if I jump over to here I also need to set the date to a place where it will give me uh, where they will have attendance so pick the 17th again and so now I've got my class list and so over here on the right instead of clicking attendance now I can take attendance here but I need to set up a seating chart so that's the second option right here. Now in order to do this what I have to do is I have to populate my seating chart. So if I start clicking plus on the rows what that does doesn't do anything because I also have to add seats. And so they kind of switch up rows and columns because traditionally columns means this way and rows means this way. And no I don't want seats that way. I want more rows like that. And so now that I have 15 seats and I have 13 students, I can click on a student. And whoops, I have to save this configuration. So I click Save. There we go. And then I click a student. And then click to where I want him or her to sit. And every time it saves it, it will give me this green notification in the upper right. And since I'm going to do this in alphabetical order to start with, I don't need to think of any other more complicated method than this. So if you have any questions on how to set up a seating chart, type them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.